Hi everyone. In this tutorial I will show you how to import multiple file names into cells in Excel. Supposing you have a folder with hundreds of files and now you want to import these file names into cells of a worksheet. Copying and pasting one by one will spend much time. In this tutorial I will talk about some quick tricks to help you uh, import multiple file names from a folder into a worksheet. The following VBA code can help you import the file names file extensions and folder name into the worksheet cells please do as follows in your worksheet that you want to import the file names hold down the alt f11 keys to open the microsoft visual basic for applications window click on the insert tab select module and paste the following vba code into the module window then press the f5 key to execute this code and in the popped out uh, browse window choose the folder that you want to import the file names from click the OK button and you will get the following result all the file names are inserted into the worksheet please note that uh, if there are subfolders within your specific folder the file names in the subfolders will not be imported Please do not forget that the link to the VBA code is provided in the video's description. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos. Hi everyone. In this tutorial I will show you how to import multiple file names into worksheet cells with KTools for Excel. If you need to import the file names both in the folder and subfolders, please don't worry. With KTools for Excel's file name list utility, you can easily import all the file names in the specific folder including the subfolders. Click the KTools plus tab. In the workbox and sheets group, click uh, the import and export drop down list and select file name list. In the file name list dialog box, do the following operations. Click this button to select the folder with the files you want to import. Click uh, on the select folder button. Check the include files and subdirectories to import the file names of the subfolders. And specify the file uh, type you want to import under the files type section. Select uh, one file size unit you want to display from the file size unit section and if you want to hyperlink the file names and folders check the create hyperlinks option and if you just want to import one specified file file type uh, from a specific folder you can check the specify option in the file name list dialog and type the file extension into it and then it will only import the specified uh, type of file names from both folders and subfolders. After finishing the settings, uh, please uh, click the OK button. And the file names both in the folder and subfolders are imported into a new worksheet as you can see. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos.